Hi guys, I'd like to welcome you guys back to my channel and today I am doing a wish list. Now, I've done wish lists on my blog. You can check it out. There should be at least one up there already about stationery and bullet journals. I'm gonna do one for makeup, artist. I'm gonna try to do all wish lists for everything that I'm interested in. But this particular one, I needed to do a video because this is my geek nerd wish list. I wanted to do a wish list this year because A, I've noticed that not a lot of women of color even dip into this side of themselves and I feel like we need representation so I'm going to start putting it out there more that this is the kind of thing that I love and I would just like to like see that community because I'm a part of those communities on Facebook and everything but I feel like we don't get love like at BlizzCon did y'all see how on BlizzCon like all the commercials like their opening ceremony and stuff it didn't have any black women on there actually yeah, I didn't see any black women at all. I saw one black guy, I think. But black women, nowhere to be found in these things. And I would like that to change. So we're gonna get started with my wish list. I probably should just go ahead and tell you guys, this list is crazy. But my first thing on my list is my Luna Lovegood wand. I know, in like my August it items, I showed you my wand that's from Jenny, but now that I'm back home, everything's leveled out. And I kind of feel like to complete a Ravenclaw, outfit I need a Ravenclaw wand and nothing against Gryffindor but I'm definitely a Ravenclaw 100% in fact I am Ravenclaw Thunderbird and if you don't know what Thunderbird is I'll link something down below for you guys to go check out on Pottermore but either way Luna Lovegood's wand and while we're still on the subject of Ravenclaw I would like Ravenclaw gear like I want Ravenclaw knee-high socks. I want Ravenclaw knee-high, no, Ravenclaw knee-high socks, regular socks, slippers, um, sweatshirt, scarf, hoodie. I just want it all. Kind of think of it as if Ravenclaw, like as if it was a college and like I could go to a store and like stock up on everything that involves Ravenclaw, I definitely would. So everything Ravenclaw, especially like a, a pajamas, like comfy like shorts and a tank top or like a tank top and some pajama pants oh, that would be so clutch uh, i want to take another step into overwatch and for those who do not know i am a diva main well it might be changing because M Miura is starting to look like the girl that might be for me so when she comes out who knows but my number one player on my playstation for me is diva I love everything about D.Va, but I especially like, I keep seeing this bomber jacket that's going around. I saw it a lot during the BlizzCon, um, during the BlizzCon feed and everything, and I saw a fitted hat. I want these things. I especially want, um, oh, and the D.Va tights where it's like the bottom of her armor, but in like legging form. I want that. So like just a whole D.Va outfit. That's what I want. I need a Harry Potter necklace, preferably a time turner or a Deathly Hollows, but like it can't be the little Deathly Hollows like my elephant. I need a Deathly Hollows to be like this. At least like take up a good portion of the middle of my chest. And the same thing for the Time Turner, because the only Time Turner that I've seen is the one where it's massive, but I want the little one and then I'll be completely set in this. The next thing that I want are the Stealth 700 headset. The reason that I like this headset is A, it's Bluetooth, B, it's wireless, and C, I can wear my glasses and not, for anybody who wears glasses and then wears over the head headphones, you know that it gives that weird pinching feeling right in the back of your ear to where like I only wear my overhead headphones when I'm not wearing my glasses. But the stuff line is saying that, you know, these are glasses friendly and I need a new headset for my PS4. So I preferably want the Stealth 700s. Have you guys even heard of that? Let me know. The next thing that I want is kind of a combination. I want the Nintendo Switch and I want Mario Odyssey. I originally, when they announced this at E3 and they showed all the demos, I loved watching that Mario because it gave me like the Nintendo 64 vibe of Mario, which hands down is still my favorite, one of my favorite Mario games, except Paper. Paper Mario was pretty dope, but like definitely one of my favorites. But the problem was the announcements for like when the games were coming out weren't exactly clear you know like the only things that they guarantee was uh that one sports game and then like zelda granted i love zelda 
but I felt like buying an entire system for one game was going to be crap. So like now they've got Zelda, Mario Kart, um, Mar- or Mario Odyssey. Uh, I think they got Super Smash too. And I feel like those games are good enough because my siblings and I grew up on game systems, but the game system that we definitely really got into as a family was the Nintendo 64 and the GameCube. Reason being, we had games like Mario Party, Super Smash, Mario, Ocarina of Time, Star Fox. We had so many games to offer. So I would like, like, I hope that they take those kind of games and like revamp them for the Switch. So if they do that, I want to add that on my wish list too. But the Switch and Mario Odyssey and um, Mario Kart are definitely on my list of things that I want this year. I want an iPad Pro. I want the 12.5 gold iPad Pro. I want the one that has cellular capabilities so that I could use it anywhere. Reason being, um, the more I have been trying to avoid getting the iPad Pro, the more I've wanted it because of... Just all the things that I could do with my iPad Pro would be phenomenal. For example, the app Procreate alone is enough for me to want the iPad Pro. It's the same way Final Cut Pro was enough for me to want the MacBook Pro. It's falling into the same lines with the Apple, and I feel like it's the easiest way for me to be able to digitize my artwork, and um, I really Really can't wait to show you guys what I've been doing with that. So it would be cool if I could use both mediums. Um, Not to mention the iPad Pro is just really, really cool. And I just really want it. I want an authentic bento box. I know that's weird. And for those who don't know, a bento box is essentially like the cutest lunchbox. I'm going to try to insert pictures, of course. But it's like... The best compartmentalized lunchbox that you could possibly imagine. And of course, it's Japanese, which just makes everything so great and so awesome. Um, But I don't know. I've always wanted an authentic one, one that keeps my food warm. And, you know, um, it's got multiple compartments. So for me, meal prep wise, it's still a perfect lunchbox for me to carry. And I don't know. I just always wanted one. I just haven't like found the one that I wanted or rather I haven't wanted to spend the money because I found a couple of them. I just haven't, you know, got what I wanted. I want a ticket to the Leaky Con and BlizzCon next year. I know that's weird for a wish list, but honestly, like, why are we not wishing, wanting these things for Christmas? Why not? Buy me a ticket to Leaky Con. Leaky Con is the Harry Potter convention that's in August in Dallas next year, by the way. And then, of course, BlizzCon is BlizzCon. I want a ticket to both of them so that I can start planning to go to both of them because I want to go to both of them next year. Um, but yeah, I'm just trying to figure that all out. So it's literally on my wish list. Nah, something on my wish list that's like extremely practical is just the the USB port that gives me the ability to use, to put in like multiple SIM cards or multiple hard drives plugins because I only have two USB ports on my MacBook and I feel like I need more. So I've just kind of been looking at like different options for that. So it's practical, but I feel like a good one would be worth like a Christmas present. Well, guys, that was it for my like tech geeky wish list. Um, What I'm going to do is create an Amazon wish list and I'm going to share it down below so that you guys could see everything that's on the wish list. And that way, if you like have no idea about it or you want to look into it, you can look into it. Um, as usual, I thank you guys so much for checking out my channel. Check the blog as always for more information. And until the next time, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Bye.